Hello friends, welcome in OCP Technology and my name is Shripal. Today I am going to show you how to install Oracle Linux 7 in VMware. You have to open VMware Workstation and uh, click on create a new virtual machine. Select typical, next. Select your ISO file. If you have a <coughs> file, then select ISO file. But if you have a CD and DVD, then select installer disk. Okay, I have ISO file, then I have select ISO file path and browse here. And then I will install the operating system later. Click here, then next. Select Linux and uh, in the version select Oracle Enterprise Linux. Then next. Lock, browse your location click here and set your location of this virtual machine create a new folder and Oracle Linux 7 ok then next giving the size maximum disk space I give 70 GB and then next click on customize hardware and providing a space of RAM how much size it will be used then click on CD DVD and use ISO image browse here and select again your ISO file this is your ISO file then ok then close finish now your machine is successfully created and uh, now I'm going to install your Oracle Linux 7 click here on power virtual machine and click inside and uh, select install oracle linux 7.0 then enter ok then select your language and your country language continue and select your software locations server with GUI and select your appropriate uh, packages which you want to store it install define in your machines ok then ok select development tool then done wait for a second it is checking the softwares then select your destinations installation destination click here this is your destinations and uh, select your I will configure up partitions select this and again click here then turn ok then select here standard partition and then add new partition I want to add swap firstly and give it the size of 4 GB to this partition and add one more partition forward slash and give remaining all space to this 60 GB ok then done accept changes 
and begin your database uh, begin your installation of your Linux now set your root user password okay then done user creation if you want to create a new user then you can create here it will take some time then for that time I want to I will be I want to uh, pause my video okay it's completed now reboot it कौन बोल रहे हैं? हैं? ओके इट्स आस्किंग योर लाइसेंस इनफॉरमेशंस एक्सेप्ट योर लाइसेंस एक्स एग्रीमेंट देन डन then there's downside is finish button click on finish then forward and finish okay then next next now create a local account give any name and uska password Suppose I create uh, Oracle as a username and password also is Oracle. Confirm password Oracle. Then next, you can select your location. Next, then start using Oracle Linux server. Okay. Now your Oracle Linux 7 installation has been completed, successfully completed. Here's the, these uh, some tutorials which is helping you how to use this Oracle Linux 7. You can use this. Suppose uh, I want to know about that use window and workspace. Click here is running like this step by step it's okay then you can use this operating system successfully Okay. 
friends now you can use your oracle linux platform it's done friends if you want to get more knowledge about oracle linux and about oracle then please you have to visit on my official website www.ocptechnology.com and you can see here the very much stuff on for of oracle linux and oracle okay let's see thank you for watching my video thank you so much